Hi, I was wondering if I could speak to a phone nurse or his, uh, my son's pediatrician. He got four shots yesterday as like a makeup and he's has like a, an extremely bad like welting rash on both his legs from his toes to his hips. Um, he can't walk. He can't walk. He, his legs like give out. So, and then yesterday he did have a fever, but I know that that can be normal. So I kind of gave him Motrin like the doctor told me to do. So should I just take him to the ER? Damn, I'm pretty stressed. Hold on. <clears throat> I don't know how to start this video. <clears throat> it could just be a rash, so maybe I'm overreacting, but... Good morning, good morning, guys. Um, let me give you guys a quick background story before we get into today's video. Basically, Levi and Alea, you guys already know, got shots yesterday, right? Ready? What's this? Is this a little squirrel guy, or what is he? <laughs> well, their, their legs were pretty sore. Um, Alea seemed pretty fine. She's been walking normally since yesterday. Here's a little example, obviously. She's walking fine. I mean, she's got a little bit of a limp, but nothing too crazy. But Levi hasn't really even been able to stand without showing signs of, of a lot of discomfort. He, every time he stands, he goes, <laughs> and if he takes a step, he starts to cry, which is obviously not normal for him. And last night, he actually came into our room in the middle of the night, Balling. We assumed it was because he had to walk from his room to our room. Which for those of you who watch often, I'm sure you know that it's not that far to get from our room to his room. This is his room. That is our room right there. And he was crying like somebody was stabbing him. So we were just like, okay, go back to sleep. You know, I used to get sore legs and I would get shots too in the butt. So I was like, okay, relax, buddy. It's going to be okay. You're, you, it, just, it just hurts because your legs are sore. Anyways, on to this morning. He's still very, very sore. Even applying pressure onto his legs hurt him. But we thought he was being a little dramatic, especially since she seems to be doing just fine, doing pretty normal stuff. So we didn't think anything of it until he asked us to go potty and I took off his pajamas and we saw his legs and they don't look good. Bubby, can we, can we see your legs? Show us where you got your boo-boos. Look at them. That's cool, huh? You got no, band-aids right here. Don't touch it, he doesn't want Obviously, to yeah. touch it. But just l look at that. Don't take my boo-boos. No, we won't take it's, them off. Is it what just a rash, did they say, or what they say? She she was on the phone with the phone nurse. So the phone nurse was in an or the no, the nurse was in an appointment. So she just told me that they're gonna have her call me back. I'm like, well, do I go to the emergency room? And she's like, well, I'm not medically trained. Yeah, well, they can't. I know. Legally, but the, they can't say anything. I'm literally my son literally has a rash, and you just are telling me to hold on. But yeah, it is. Oh, they did give him so many vaccines because we hadn't gone in a while, so they had to catch up. And you, we don't know any better. Like we don't know what's going on. We just trust what the doctors say. You know what I mean? So. We hope, we hope, we hope everything's okay. I think it's just a rash. He probably had an allergic reaction to one of the medicines or something in one of the vaccines. But it's so mad. Yeah, I know, but it's hard not to freak out when it's your child and we don't know what exactly is going on. <clears throat> You're okay, Latishi. I know, I am. I don't, I'm just, it's frustrating. Like, how, I don't know, it's just frustrating. They, they did say, they, they did specify how their bodies could handle it. But maybe it's just an allergic reaction to something this. in the vaccine. They said he can have a fever, give him some Motrin. Yeah. Now he's gonna break out in hives. Uh, we're gonna lay you down, okay? Just cause it's more comfy that way, yeah, okay? It causes him discomfort to even lay, like, with pressure. He came in my I'm room. Not. He's not I'm gonna not. take no, it off, baby. I don't wanna take your band-aids off. You we're gonna to leave that. another band-aid? Okay, we won't touch it. I just wanna show them your legs. Look, I'm gonna, it, oh, baby. Don't touch it. Okay, don't touch, touch it. Your underwear? No. Just don't touch okay, it, it's fine. okay. But look at this. I, the camera it? just like doesn't show it. I no, just don't even know how to explain it. It won't pick it up. Look at that. Can I straighten your leg out just a little it's bit? It's not gonna touch your bandage. Don't so worry. this is like where the majority of the rash is. It just looks like a big welt uh, on this side too. It's right next to his shots, obviously. And it goes up his. He doesn't want us to touch. I'll so just touch his underwear. Let me <laughs> see your underwear. <laughs> is that funny? <laughs> Wait. So oh, I won't touch your bandaid. I'll just don't touch worry, the underwear. Buddy. But look, it goes all the way up his leg on this side. And up into his back. Eh. Oh, God. Don't scare him. I know. Daddy's looking at your boobas. You're a strong boy, huh? Oh. Yeah. The thing is, it doesn't itch. I don't know if it's supposed to itch. I said boobas, and I think he thinks I mean boobs. Oh. 
<laughs> Silly. But yeah, this side of the leg goes all the way up his back. Can I see your back, buddy? We'll turn around a little bit. If it hurts, just let me know, okay? Onto that side. I haven't seen his booty yet, but it ends right there. I think it's just an allergic reaction. I was a little stressed at first, but I'm hoping that it's just maybe something in the vaccine. Does it hurt? Like, does it cause pain? I don't know, but he can't stand on them. And we were wondering all morning why he was having such a hard time, and she was fine. Let's actually check her legs as well. And she doesn't have it. She got very mad. That's why I'm saying I checked. Oh, okay. Yeah. Checked. You're upset? I don't know. Well, at least we'll find out. Hopefully, this is a a good learning curve. Well, Hopefully, we find like, that he's allergic to something. No, what to no, like? No, we don't know. I'm just trusting no, we, the. Doctor. I think doctors don't even know because we don't know what he's allergic to or not yet. We're gonna. If it's, it's trial an and error. Reaction, then yeah, like that's nothing that we mm -hmm. could have avoided. That shit was just gonna. But if it has to do with the fact that we gave him four, like Oscar and I made it such a big deal that we were nervous about that. Yeah, we were both like, uh, should we just do two? And they were kind of like, well, it would save them a lot of trauma if we just did them all at once. So we were kind of like, oh yeah, that makes sense. You know, why make him come back and have to experience more shots? Like we weren't. Yeah, that's the thing. We had good intentions. We didn't want them to have to suffer twice. So we're like, yeah. So, and she said they do that all the time. Yeah. And they looked it up, and some people get nine shots. Did yeah. You know that? That's so much. So I was like, oh, okay, it should be fine. But that's what we're dealing with this morning, and we don't know. I guess we'll just wait for the phone nurse to call. We don't know whether to go to the emergency room or to just stay here. But yeah, even movement of his legs hurts. Hey, just relax. Let it, let his feet go down, yeah. Oh god. There, there, there. Put your leg in. I'm sorry, buggy. There, all I'm done. sorry. All done. Like that. Good job. Good I'm strong sorry, boy. baby. You're okay. We love you. Okay. You're a strong boy. Luckily, his personality is still here. It's just when he walks. Yeah, he's still sucks. Levi. They're like, uh -uh, I know. Well, I don't. I still don't know if he's being dramatic about the walking part. I don't know if hives hurt. Dude, look at his legs. I know. I know. I'm not. That's why it's like we're letting it happen. If they don't hurt. He's got to be sore. If they, if he looks really uncomfortable. Like <laughs> you okay? Got you. I got you. Uh huh. <laughs> Obviously, I feel extremely bad for him, and in no way am I trying to like make fun of a serious situation, but. It's just funny to me because Oscar's not really a sympathetic person. Sympathetic? Well, sympathetic. For crying, for crying for no reason, yeah. Kira doesn't like how I tell him not to cry all the time. Yeah, like, well, he's just, we've, it's, yeah, he's usually just doesn't really feel bad for them. And so it's just funny and cute that he feels so bad. Like, he's, like, literally going to get him a wheelchair when we get there. I know it. Yeah. And like I said, I don't mean to frighten you or anything, yeah. but I, I don't think that's something that want, is going to happen. I just want you aware of what to look for. Yeah. Okay? Okay. All right. Now, if he starts becoming, like, not alert, like... Maggie, how are you feeling? You doing okay, Bobby? Yeah? You okay? I mean, it's so hard to know. Like, does the child look gray? How do you know? I mean, no, I'm I don't sure think he looks know, gray, right? but he does seem a little out of it. He does seem worse. tired. Like, that's what I felt, like, earlier. But it's hard because it's also, like, I yeah, don't, we know. don't know. We're not we'll doing see. anything that requires energy. I don't really yeah. know. This is stressful, man. So I don't really know how to feel after that conversation with the phone nurse, but it doesn't seem like she's too worried. And we were in a lot better of a mood when we looked up what hives are. I've never had hives. I've heard a lot of people get them. Kier's never had hives either, but obviously she's heard a lot of people getting them in her life before. And when we looked up hives, it looks exactly like what Levi has. You probably can't see that very well. But it says very common, usually self-treatable, usually self-diagnosable, and lab tests are imaging rarely, or lab tests or imaging Imaging rarely required resolves within days within days to weeks. So we were we weren't worried at all. We were laughing. We we're kind of like, okay, let's well, go check him out. We saw yeah. that at home, so it kind of brought us. Yeah, that's why we were comfort. being like a little silly when we got into the car. Like, oh, okay, maybe we were just overreacting. Well, because be at first when we Oscar first noticed it, I mean, I instantly just was like shaking. We're getting stuck behind every slow truck in the universe. Mm -hmm. it's never gonna get there. Hey, but this truck is destined for greatness. So, <laughs> if there's speed. any truck we should be behind, it Slow is this and one. Steady wins the race. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining, uh huh? Yeah, the world is sad that your legs are hurting. It's sad.
We don't think they're going to give you shots right now. They're just okay. going to check. Right now, they're just checking your legs. No shots right now. They just okay. want to see that redness. Remember that redness? Like how Daddy and Mommy looked at your legs earlier? We're just going to take your PJs off. Dude, Here, no Oscar, shots. let's switch. Let's switch. They will not do anything mean to you, okay? Mommy and Daddy are both here to protect you. Okay. Hey, look, let's look, let's look at your red legs. You remember? Do you remember? We want to show red? you. Can we show you, you your me, legs? You want me to show you daddy's legs? You're okay. Sorry. Hi. Sorry, we're, we're, to... we're trying to get him to take his PJs off. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm one of the doctors here. Okay, hi. This is Levi? Yeah. Yes. Hey, buddy. Yes. Look, it's not that big of a deal. No one's going to well, hurt we'll you. We'll put that right back on that so right much. leg. But it was just an hour ago. It was all, yeah. we'll show you clips from earlier. So some with his next yeah. set of shots, I would just give him Benadryl beforehand to prevent him from getting. She, she, they did say his next one is until he's five. Of course, as usual, when you come to the doctor, whatever symptoms you were having are just all of a sudden <laughs> gone. But his legs are looking so much better. Oh, sorry. Well, as I was saying before the nurse came in, yeah, he's looking so much better. We don't want to take his PJs off right now to show you because it's kind of still a painful process for him to move his legs and for us to touch him and shove him back into his PJ holes. So, PJ holes. Oh yeah, his PJ foot holes. Foot holes. But he's looking way better. They gave him some Benadryl. Hopefully that'll make it go away completely. They said to give him some tonight. And yeah. Yeah. That was a little embarrassing that we came and he I'm had so barely, he had like came. this big of a rash though. I, I'm so glad he came though. Yeah, like, for sure. It was scary this morning. Was, I was ter I was so angry, mm -hmm. so sad. Me too. And so Scared. I was stressed, but at least now we know what hives are, what they look like, and to know that they're they not that serious. They did say because he got so many shots, they don't mm -hmm. know which one it is. So when he gets his five-year-old shots, we're going to have to give him Benadryl before uh -huh. because we don't know what he had a reaction yeah. to. Is that fun? No? <laughs> He's like, that's pushing it down. Yeah, no. Well, fun is not <laughs> the right word. I'm stripping down for the nurses. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty guys, back at the house. It has now been a few hours and we're gonna go ahead and give a little Levi update. He is uh, still not walking. Rash is completely gone, I think. Yeah, even it's it's gone from his face as well because it was getting a little bit on his face, but ended up going away now. We haven't really checked if it's tender to touch. Yeah, okay, so it's, okay, sorry, I was just checking. But yeah, it's still tender to the touch. He doesn't like it when there's any kind of pressure on it. He hasn't been active at all today. He's pretty much just been sitting on the couch or in his chair to eat. He took a bath for a little bit, but he just sat there. So we decided to just put him in bed, let him hang out, watch cartoons, and just rest. What are you up to, my little mind skin? Trying to get some sympathy too for some. I know, huh? Look, she's got playing with the band-aid. She's like, you know, I still need these. <laughs> Just because I'm tougher than my brother doesn't mean I'm fully okay. You want some band-aids on? Want me to put it on? No, because then she's going to want to open all of them. <laughs> that's not teacher. No, that's not teacher that those are like sticker thingies. Oh, I guess that's true. Yeah, that these is are a cute bad like idea. Shock yes, ones. that is a bad idea. It still blows my mind that they reacted so differently to this. Well, I guess. Actually, no, she got the same amount of vaccines as he did. No, she actually and got missing the same one. Yeah. She got five vaccines, four shots, because they mixed one, and yeah. Le Levi got four shots. I honestly and think... Four vaccines, too. Yeah. I think that a lot of people, including myself, assumed it was about it being four shots, when I think that it could have just been one. I mean, like... Yeah, the, well, that's what the, the doctor today said, that we don't know which one causes allergic yeah. reactions. Like, he had an allergic... Was. Yeah, like, I don't know. It's just so hard. I felt so guilty, but, like... Yeah. Honestly, it's better that yeah. we did it that way. I still would have done it that way because otherwise we'd be going back next month to get more. And yes. you guys saw how he was today. He yeah. is not about to let a doctor give him another shot. Yeah, no, he doesn't trust doctors anymore. So it wouldn't have changed. I mean, the allergic reaction would have happened either way. He's got a new song that she likes to sing. Do you know what it is? I actually don't know what it is. You want to sing your song? Is. Ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray. Hooray! Is that it? If you're happy and you know it, touch your toes. Touch your toes. If you're happy and you know it's somersault. Oh, your mom's not doing that one. If you're happy and you know it's somersault. Can you do it? There you go. Oh, oh, you want to clap? 
If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. One more time. Oh my god, we're stuck doing this all night. Okay, Daddy, here. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. One, two. No, you know how. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't see you behind that cord there. All right, Sissy. Yeah, there you go. You got the pencil. And now let's see. Can you draw a circle? Uh, nope. <laughs> Wait, like this one. Look, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Daddy, show you. Okay, that, that is my circle. <laughs> yeah, That's an awesome circle. Circle. That's not a circle. No, she just did double circles. Did no, motion. that's the point. Okay, try it again. Can you draw a circle? No, wait, wait, wait. There you oh, go. Good nice job. Turn. She's making lots of circles. Baby, I don't think that's the Baby, point. Baby, yes it is. Come on, come on, come on. Use that big brain and let's just do one circle. Okay, can you just draw one? Draw one circle. Look, let me show you. Can you do this one? Draw this one, ready? One circle. Just like that. You try. She's like, okay, just ready? kidding. Your turn, go. One circle. <laughs> She does the motion. Is that she what the Yes, means? yes. That she can like make the motion of a Fair. circle. Uh, try again. Just one. Just one. <laughs> oh, no. Just one. Doctors need to be more specific with you because they say circle and you want her to be there Picasso. You there you go. Just like that. Okay, look. Just one. Just, just one. Stop right there. <laughs> okay, ready? Let me show you. Okay, sneaks. It's that time of day when we go to bed. Favorite time of day. For those of you wondering how her no phone sleeping is going a while back, we took her phone away. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. But she's doing so much better. We still give her her phone about like once a week, just as like a reward for doing well for the week, if that makes sense. I'm sure some of you still think that's probably too much, but I think once a week is totally dandy. It's funny though, because instead of the phone, she does things like this, like she found this piece of paper and she's just ripping it apart. Uh. The things that your imagination does when it doesn't have a phone, huh? I love you. Uh, hey, hey, you want me to read? Yeah. I am sitting down. <laughs> then rest your head, drift off to sleep. Eat. Oh. Eat. Okay. All right, just quickly came to check up on Levi, and as you could tell, he's getting the rash again. It's spreading pretty fast. It's literally only been maybe 45 minutes since we were last in here. And look, his ear is bright red. Um, his cheek is super, super welted or hivy. I don't know how you would say that, but it's obviously got a rash. Hopefully, though, the Benadryl that I just gave him will help that go down. Doctor said we should give him a little bit tonight if it continues or gets worse. So we did. Actually, I don't even know if she said if it continues or get worse. She said a Benadryl tonight might help. So since we only have the adult-sized ones or the adult milligram portions, I cut it in half because that's what kids are allowed to have, 12.5. The whole thing is 25 milligrams, and a kid of his weight is supposed to have 12.5. So that's what we did. We just cut the 25 in half, but I kind of wish I recorded how I did it because I grabbed the half exactly like the one I just showed you and smashed in one of these cookies and he loved the cookie until he got to the bite of the banjo and he was like Ugh. Ugh, you gave me yucky cookie, so I'm gonna give him a good cookie like I promised because he was not satisfied with the yucky cookie. This one shouldn't be as yucky. Yeah, it should be a lot better. Oh no, your rash is getting worse fast, buddy. Really, really fast. I'm gonna let him enjoy his cookie though. Um, yeah, he's starting to itch a lot of a lot right now. So we decided to just put him in our bed in our room tonight, just because that way we can keep a closer eye on him. Yeah, and if we hear him wheezing or something, breathing yeah. bad, we'll just be like, we'll be we'll be yeah, able right. to hear it and notice it. Mm -hmm. But the rash on his rash on his face went away. Yeah, it looks so yeah. much better. It's still a little bit red, but it's going away. But then over here, this has happened in five minutes. Yeah. I'll show you guys the before picture and the af pic after picture. Why can't we speak today? I don't know. Oh my gosh. It's getting late. Yeah, the after picture. This happened in five minutes. 
and it's just kind of worsening. But he's been itching at this one like extremely so, yeah, bad. I think itching makes it worse, obviously. Yeah, but he wasn't itching his face. Sure he's, use he's itching his he arm. Did, he did itch his face, and it did get bad fast after he started. Oh, he did itch it. Yeah. Oh, I didn't see. That's why it started. Yeah, but the the arm that was like the fastest I've seen it spread. It's so weird. Yeah, it's like it the weirdest fast thing. And moves around. But we but gave him Benadryl. We can't give him any more. At least not for four to five hours. I think I need to read the exact directions. Um, Oscar and I are actually when Kylie gets home gonna go pick him up some real kids Benadryl just because I feel more comfortable with that. I think Oscar does too. You wanna say good night with me? Say good night. Good night, bug buddies. Oh, you're good at it. The, the bug buddies like it if we say it like this. Good night. Sleep tight. We're gonna love and miss you guys. <laughs> okay. Well, good night, guys. No, no, no. Oh. <gasps> Whoa. Almost. No. 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 Oh, he got us. You jump. Yeah, I need to jump. I told you. <laughs> <laughs> hey everyone, it's Kira. And Oscar. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys want to check out our last video, click here. If you would like to subscribe to our channel, click here. If you want to check out my personal channel, click here. And if you want to check out my personal channel, click there. We, we hope, hope you enjoyed. enjoyed. See you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye guys. <laughs>